Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. If you just close your eyes and imagine, you can almost smell the brats cooking. Nothing says football season like a good old-fashioned matchup in the Big Ten as two old conference rivals square off in this one. That's going to do it for us. Thanks for checking out the pregame show. NCAA college football action coming right at you. Brad and Kirk on the call. David and I are back at halftime. field to kick this one off and everyone in the stadium is ready for this game to get started gross from the three gets to about the 24 yard line the Buckeyes have got a guy at quarterback that is a true leader we found that out this week talking to him we sure did Brad it was interesting this week and as you and I prepared for this game finding out that he called a players only meeting without any of the coaches just to get this team focused and let them understand what it takes to go on the road and to win this kind of game. And when you have that kind of leadership, you get a real chance to be able to go on the road and win. Ohio State's got a guy that statistically is leading the conference right now, and he has got the attention of everybody in the country, including the coordinator. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. White picks up about four yards on the play. at the 42. The play was very well conceived as they were able to get a decent gain and a first down. So the ground game picks up another first down. Well, this really works on a defense's psyche. You can see the guys on defense right now just trying to catch their win. Once again, they had a chance to bring this drive to a halt, but were unable to do it. The offense really seems to be clicking right now. He's tackled the 37-yard line. That's good for a game of eight yards. That'll bring up second and three. Gives it left side. Gains his way to the 29-yard line. Call it a gain of eight yards. Too easy. First down. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. Mike 40, Mike 40. Hey, hey other side. Bruin, Bruin. Here's an opening. 
Big play, and it's first and goal. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. And they make the stop at the eight-yard line. Harrison comes away with two yards on the quarterback keeper. He was playing the run all the way and was able to stop him quickly. Good job by that senior safety. Touchdown, Buckeyes. When you're that close to the end zone, it's always a smart play to find your blockers and follow them into the end zone. And he converts the extra point. So a 12-play, 74-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. It can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. From his own goal line, and he's tackled at the 29-yard line. The quarterback brings his troops out out of the field for the first drive of the game. This quarterback is tough as nails. Brad, he's going to sit in that pocket and give himself a chance. The only problem is, at some point, you've got to have a feel. Almost that sixth sense on when to get out of there and avoid the pressure, or just to throw the ball before you get hit. He's under pressure. Well, the defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack, but somehow he's able to throw the ball away. From their own 29-yard line, third down. Here we go, here we go. Strike to his receiver, no good. They couldn't pick up the first down, so they'll have to punt this one away. It was a good hold by the defense on third down. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. Carpenter is the punter. Got the corner. Tackle at the 42-yard line. The Buckeyes offense, I thought, answered the doubters big time with an impressive opening drive, and they got on the board first. Yeah, when you're in a hostile environment, you want to play with a little bit of a chip on your shoulder and just show people that you're not intimidated by the environment. They sure did that that first time out. Ohio State up seven points. Nice run there. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. Quickly to the tight end, incomplete. There's one the quarterback would like to rewind because he has a wide open receiver and he just misfires. From the 20 yard line, second down. Makes it out to about the 10. That makes it first and goal. And he's tackled right around the 10 yard line. He makes it out to maybe the seven-yard line. 
makes this third and goal. The defense has really held their own the last two plays. Now it's third and goal from the seventh. Now we'll see how the backup can do after that injury. Hands it to the back. And now he's got room to run. Strong run by the halfback to get into the end zone. He's a pretty sure bet to get six when you're this close to the end zone. And he hits the PAT. A nice seven-play, 42-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. So our score... 14 nothing. Looks like they're ready for the kick. The Buckeyes quarterback, we saw him taken out earlier down there on the sideline after being injured. I don't think he's in that much pain right now, though, and I would bet that he'll be back in the game before today's done. He got hit hard. It's not quite a blowout, but unless they do something here, it might turn into one. Give to the tailback. Knocked out of bounds at the 36. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. My five, my five, my five. Green eye, green. He's taken down at the 39. And the tailback picks up the first down. Smart run. Maybe it won't look great on the stat sheet, but getting the first is what matters. As we change into the field, I don't think we're going to be seeing much of a change in the outcome. 14 nothing, Ohio State. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. Roger, Roger. Mike five, Mike five. Let's go deep. Red to it. Ah. He airs it out. Incomplete. Well, he must have hurried there because his receiver was wide open. There was no need to rush that one at all. Second and ten. Ball on the 39. Let's go. Let's bring it. Let's bring it. High five. High five. Black five. Go. 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 Tackled after a decent run up the gut. Inside handoff makes it out to about the 46. From the 46 yard line, first down. Going left on the counter. And he's taken down at the 32 yard line. Two. No gain on the play. That makes it second and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive. Four down, four down. My five. My five. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Quick pass tight end, and he wasn't ready for it. So we're looking at another third down here. Incomplete. Number 84, the intended receiver on the play. That'll make it fourth and ten. Matthews is the deep man awaiting the return. And it goes out of bounds at the five yard line. 
you think about the challenges these two teams are facing on one side you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead and on the other side you've got to find a way to get back in it gets out to around the 18. Quick throw. He's out to the 30. Brought down around the 35 yard line. What we're seeing right now is just a great connection between the quarterback and his receivers. They make these plays look effortless. The cavalry's coming. Rose, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. Great range as he's able to break up the pass. I know that the safety makes a good play here, but as a receiver, you got to get in there and play some defense. He's lucky that one wasn't intercepted. He steps out at the 38-yard line. He's got his half back. And they push him out at midfield. That's a gain of 12 on the play. First down. Here we go, here we go. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. Mike 40, Mike 40. Check, check. He's coming, he's coming. Check four, check four. Looks for the tight end, but they can't hook up. From midfield. It's second down. And now he's got room to run. Gets to around the 42. That's a game I made on the way. That'll bring up third and two. Brought down. That's a game of six on the play. play. That makes it first and ten. Ain't no such thing as a loss. We take a win. Check my forty. Check my forty. Down. Take four. Take four. Gets to about the thirty-four yard line. Gains his way to the 26 yard line. Gaining eight on the play. First down. No gain on this defense. No gain. Mike 40, Mike 40. Check that. Right line. Ken Boston. Deep ball laying it out there. He's got it. Touchdown. Well, this is one of those plays you just sit back and admire. The quarterback threw the ball perfectly. And again, the speed of the receiver is the difference in this play. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Time for an update from the studio. Reese, what have you got? They are lighting up the scoreboard again in the Big 12. And for SMU, they continue their winning way. And for Henry, he winds up with a couple of touchdown passes. The Mustangs win it 30 to 16. All right, Reese, back to our game. Wilson's Bellamy ready to kick. <laughs> He's to the 20. He gets hit out of bounds at about the 25-yard line. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. And it's 
caught, and he's brought down quickly. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. Red two. Let's go. He's in trouble. Tackle around the 31-yard line. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Throws it out, and it falls incomplete. Number 84 was the intended receiver on the play. That brings up fourth and three. Carpenter is waiting for the snap. Down he goes at the 49. Ohio State's offense is just clicking on all cylinders, Herbie, right now. It's everything they planned for, and it's all working. Everything is coming together for this offense. They seem to be getting better with each series. And, you know, this game started where this team was, you know, they wondered if they were going to be able to move the ball against this defense. And I think right now, I think they seem to, as I said earlier, they seem to be growing with their confidence with each possession. And he is drilled at the 49-yard line. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. And that was the sophomore linebacker there who was able to get in and make that tackle. From the 49-yard line, it's second down. He's scrambling. Tackle made around the 38-yard line. And that was a nice pickup by the quarterback. Brad, I think this guy's amazing. He has an uncanny ability to scramble, and it showed right there on that play. He's going to try and scramble. He's tackled at the 22-yard line. This is a pretty tough guy, and he's a great leader. He's going to do whatever it takes to help his team. Set. Blue 14. Check, check. Eight. Now he tries to buy some time. He'll run it again. What a play, and that is first and goal. That's good. Check three. Check three. Scrambling around. And he's going to run this one in. Touchdown. You hate to say that a game is over so early, but unless they make some incredible changes and fast, I just don't see how they can come back from this. And he adds the extra point. It was a five-play, 49-yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. And Brad, right now, the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches, opening up some big running lines. Ohio State to kick. Wilson, from the three, gets to about the 24-yard line. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Play action. And down he goes, right around the 28-yard line. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 28-yard line. We've still got a half of football remaining. Ohio State's running away with it. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Chris Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. I really hope you'll stick around and watch the second half of this game. During the second half, I expect Kirk Herbstreit to give us a comprehensive history of every playbook he's ever had in his entire football career, dating back to Pee Wee. That would be infinitely more interesting than having to watch the second half of this blowout. <laughs> Definitely, uh, that would be probably more entertaining. We get on games all the time, they start to get out of hand, you gotta empty the bucket. So guys, 
back to you. Have some fun. Tell me something I don't know. These teams are pretty boring. Give me something from the human interest file, Brad Nessler. That's going to do it at halftime. Just about ready to start the second half. All right, you finish it up, brother. I'm going to get something in the cafeteria. I'm hungry. But, look, wait. Don't leave until you get my order. Brad Kirk, take the second half. All right, Reese and David, you guys just sit there in your easy chairs. Kirk and I have work to do here in this third quarter. Hopefully, it's going to get better. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 20-yard line. Ohio State's the type of team, when you look at them, it looks like their defense sort of just feeds off itself. I think the energy is there, Brad, but I think it really starts up front with their defensive line and their linebackers, the way they're being able to just win the battle at the line of scrimmage. I think it's giving them confidence, and it's allowing them to play more downhill where they can attack this offense. Here comes the pressure. Rose intercepts. No, he dropped it. Quantum to the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second. And From their own 20 yard line. Second down. Three down, three down. High five. Red two. Finds his man. First down. And they make the stop at the 38. Superb effort by the receiver to come down with that ball. Well, this comes down to the timing between the quarterback and the receiver. And the result, again, a nice play for the offense. From their own 38-yard line. First down. It out. And he's tackled at the 45 yard line. yard line. It's first down. down 10 yards to go ball on the 25 yard line black five black five go. got a man watch out here he's knocked out of bounds right around the 14 yard line and this play is number eight on the drive They get nice yardage on that run. That's a game four That'll make it second and seven. From the ten yard line. Second down. Nice play to set up first and goal. Here's play number ten on the drive. pitches it that's a great tackle at the four these guys have the capability to gain solid consistent yardage they have to regroup come out a bit more motivated next time that brings up a second and goal four yards out red two easy easy hand off to the left he's taken down right around the six yard line 
makes his third and goal. And this is the 12th play of the drive. Finds a man, touchdown. He fired it out to his wide receiver who made the grab and got the score. When this guy's got time to throw, he makes the defense pay. And he tacks on the extra point. So a 12-play, 79-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 36-yard line. Boy, this offense has been consistent throughout this entire football game. The quarterback's doing a good job of leading this team. How about the offensive line, the job that they've done? Just a great team effort to allow this offense to have a spectacular performance. They're ready to begin another drive. He's at midfield, and he hits him hard at the 45. That's good for a game of 19 yards. First down. Oh, you got deep? Hey, go on, Mike 40, Mike 40. And he makes it out to about the 44-yard line. That's a deal of one on the play. That brings us second to nine. Scrambling. It's on the ground. Picked up by the defense. Oh. I'll tell you, when a guy as big as this lineman gets his paws on a loose ball, you can pretty much forget about it. You're not getting the ball back from him. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And he tackles them hard at the 28. That is a loss of seven on the play. That'll make it second and long. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. He fires this one. And he's level at the 47. First and ten. Ball on the 35. Nice run up the middle. That makes it second and six. Receiver, no good. Third down now. They need to get it to the 25. He guns it. 
gets broken up. That's three down and one to go. Ohio State's got a three touchdown advantage. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. the 17 yard line that makes it second and six we're at play number nine of this current drive red throws complete and he's hit right away It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. 87 the ball. 87 the ball. Mike, Tackle after a decent run up the gut. This is the 11th play of this drive. Nice run. Brought down. That brings up second goal. From the one yard line, it's second down. Tailback run down for a loss. Excellent job by the defense to diagnose the play so quickly. This is really a well coached unit. This is the 13th play of this drive. This defense not wanting to give an inch here. McCall sweeps left. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. That brings us fourth and goal. So it's fourth and goal from the five, and the offense is still on the field trying to put this in for six. Just under three to go in regulation. Nearly intercepted. It's always a gamble going for it with so many yards to come up with. But when you're behind, sometimes you have to take risks to get back into a ball game. The offense just wasn't able to make a play. The defense was really clutch right there. The offense comes out of the field, and they're hoping to avoid the similar fate that killed their last drive. The defense, I'm sure, will be aggressive again. They love going for the strip and attacking the football. He gets out to about the nine-yard line. From their own nine-yard line, second down. Gets another handoff. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's a game of six on the Third down. Double tight, double tight. Four down, four down. Max, Max 40, Max 40. Six, Tech six, Tech six. Tech seven, Tech six. At about the 43 yard line. That's a team of 28 on the play. First down. From 
from their own 43-yard line. First down. We have less than a minute to go. Tackle made at the 48. That brings him second and one. That's the end of the ball game and our final score in this one, 28 to seven, Buckeye. As we wrap this game up, Kirk, what final thoughts do you want to share? Well, no doubt about it, this is a pretty big mismatch. Penn State actually played a good ball game today. They just didn't have the horses to match their counterpart. They need to start recruiting to build this program back up. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.